Item number SCP-126 Object Class Euclid Special Containment Procedures SCP-126 is kept within a standard Euclid-class humanoid containment cell, despite not having needs consistent with that of a normal human or any kind of nourishment, as this environment has proven the most effective in keeping SCP-126 contained. In case of a containment breach, acoustic sensors embedded within SCP-126's containment cell, as well as the entire wing in which SCP-126's cell is housed, can be used to locate SCP-126. Firm but polite verbal requests for SCP-126 to return to its cell are to be given until it complies. Personnel interacting with SCP-126 must undergo regular psychiatric screening, and personnel exhibiting emotional attachment to SCP-126 must be administered a Class B amnestic and reassigned. Description: SCP-126 is an invisible and intangible entity that can only be identified via sound. SCP-126 is sentient, with the ability to speak in multiple languages in a female voice and engage in conversation with any subject within range. To date, no method by which SCP-126 can be visually detected has been devised, as SCP-126 does not appear to emit any kind of light, radiation, heat, or electromagnetic energy. SCP-126 does appear to occupy an area, as evidenced by the ability to triangulate its suggested location via its voice. SCP-126 also emits sound when moving consistent with footsteps made by a human subject wearing high heels, with a mass of approximately 55 to 60 kg. Though no depressions can be seen in any floor materials, and pressure sensors do not register any kind of presence. SCP-126 cannot pass through barriers that would prevent a normal human subject from passing, such as a closed door, but solid objects can be pushed through the space it occupies without any effect. For unknown reasons, SCP-126 will comply with any request for it to follow a specific human subject or move to a specific location without question, though it may move away afterwards or if it is not able to physically comply with the request. SCP-126 will engage in conversation with any personnel within its containment cell, preferring topics such as art, nature, and philosophy. SCP-126 exhibits knowledge of current topics and intelligence consistent with that of a college graduate, as well as moderate attention deficit disorder. SCP-126 will regularly change language without reason and stray off topic while conversing without warning. Attempts to question SCP-126 about its origin or nature have been unsuccessful, as SCP-126 becomes confused when presented with such questions, and will quickly stray away from the topic. Despite not appearing to use or need any furniture or appliances, SCP-126 will request such items as a bed, dresser, mirror, or other sundries if not present, and is more likely to stay within a room if such items are available. A small number of personnel exhibit anomalous behavior after engaging in conversation with SCP-126, including, but not limited to believing that they have known SCP-126 for many years, and that SCP-126 is a close friend or loved one. If not treated, these subjects will begin to ignore basic needs in order to continue conversing with SCP-126 eventually dying from dehydration or starvation. SCP-126 was discovered in a suburban home in after several reports of the house being haunted. A Foundation containment team was able to quickly locate SCP-126 and, after conversing for several minutes, convinced SCP-126 to enter a mobile containment unit, which was used to transfer it to a local Foundation containment site. Addendum 126-01 Researcher Note To date, conversations with SCP-126 have yielded several notable personality traits. SCP-126 is mildly arachnophobic and will move away from any specimens 
introduced to its containment cell. SCP-126 exhibits a desire to assist with any task which it believes it can be of help, despite being unable to manipulate objects. SCP-126 prefers to converse with male subjects that exhibit humor and intelligence. SCP-126 expresses a desire to have children, and has conversed with staff on several occasions regarding child care methodology. SCP-126 has the ability to fluently speak English, French, German, Portuguese, Spanish, and at least three other unknown languages. Dr. B Senior Researcher